Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Ignatius. How are you? Good, good, good. How are you today? How is everything there? Good. Michigan is good. Starts with winter, right? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, you love this weather? This is, this is captain of cold. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I sent you a video so that you can go through the video and download and install java program on your computer as well as eclipse ide could you I already installed two of them. okay you already installed it I, I, last night i installed uh, i installed java and then fantastic. i installed eclipse, eclipse fantastic ID. did you yeah. did you test it is it working and, uh, the 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 Java thing, he just keeping at I telling me, you know, whatever I, I allow them to access to to change my uh, my listen my computer setting. Okay. Okay. Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> now you have become junior QA <laughs> engineer. Okay. <laughs> Okay, no problem, no problem. But uh, uh, the, the Eclipse ID, you know, the, I opened that one, it said there's no, no project. No project, okay, no problem, no problem. No problem. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me, let me show you some more concepts in java program first okay then during the practice session we will check your um eclipse ide and java java okay, whatever you install yeah, yeah. okay okay so this okay. can you can you see my screen yeah i can see your screen yeah fantastic okay now in the last tutorial Yes. I think I showed you this much, right? Uh, I don't think so, no. No? Yeah, because you know, you know, I lost Okay, okay, no problem. I'm showing it from the very beginning, okay? Okay. From the very beginning, I am going to show you everything from scratch okay. i'm going to create a project look very carefully i just click on file okay then go then i take project not java project this time i'm taking okay. this project okay again let me show you i go to file click on new go straight then go one step down and i click on project project okay. then i just type okay. here maven okay i type here maven then click on maven project then click again on next button okay then okay. check in create simple project remember at the very beginning i told you at the very beginning it might seem intimidating it might seem a little difficult but once you practice several times you become comfortable okay then just click okay. on next 
now new probin new maven project this new maven project kind of dialog box has been pop up okay then i just type com dot whatever application i want to test i'm going to test facebook.com say for example not necessary to test facebook let's 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 test any other application say for example bank of america com dot bank of america b o a i think someone here i think okay and uh, vincent is here vincent is working with me one on one basis and he is uh, going to complete first month okay okay he become little expert now he can teach us okay 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 uh, welcome mr vincent okay very welcome let me show you with facebook because this is most common application okay and you can practice all the time com dot facebook let me show with it then art effect id is the name of the project okay let me let me name it fb fb functionality test project okay name of the project is fb functionality test then just click on finish okay now you see i have a lot of projects this is package explorer we call it also project explorer so there are more than one project there can be more than one project but we we remember the name of our project is fv functionality test and i just click at greater than sign this is the drop down okay, okay. and i find lot of files and folders have been created automatically okay okay now this is maybe that behind the scene created all these folders and files that are necessary for us okay now the first two package or folders are usually used by the developers so we are not going to touch it right now the third package src slash test slash java this is for the test engineers for us okay src test slash resource this is also for us and this is src another source folder this is pom.xml pom.xml is a file where we can uh, just copy and paste the dependencies in maybe in pom.xml file we just copy and paste the dependencies dependencies are nothing but software that we require that we need for our project okay okay whenever you want to talk please unmute anytime now first i just click on pom.xml file and i just type dependencies 
because there will be more than one dependency so dependency dependencies okay this is a tag name of this tag is dependencies this is opening tag and this is closing tag uh, the difference between opening tag and closing tag is can you see the difference between these two the first one dependency doesn't have this slash right but closing tag does have slash okay now inside this two we will just copy the dependencies we need where we can find our dependency can you tell me mr l v z g o where we can find the dependencies uh, mvn mvn repository repository yeah google yeah sorry repository dot okay First we need is Java, Selenium Java, Selenium-Java, okay? First we need is Selenium-Java. I just type Selenium with Java. Let me make it a little bigger so that you can see it. Then press enter or you can click on search, okay? You see, Selenium Java is dependency dependency means software that we need for our project so i just click here and scroll down you see there are several versions for this dependency or software selenium java i just click one of them I am taking the latest one okay just click here right button click and copy okay I copy then I come back to my project in between these dependencies I just paste here whatever I copied I paste here okay then go back to mbnrepository.com then type web driver manager okay web driver manager then click here and click on web driver manager I choose the latest one then just click here and right button click copy go back and I paste here okay then again go back i need one more what do i need actually i don't need any more but i want to bring test ng because i want to show you also test ng test ng is a framework that is very popular from framework in the software development and testing industry tests ng means next generation okay next generation i'm taking the latest one and just click here copy then go back to our project and i just paste here okay wonderful now what i can do i can make it more readable we call it we call it indentation i just highlight it okay select it then press on tab button one time and second time i press on tab button okay then then look very carefully here there will be a green mark okay. when I save it. 
how we save on computer we just press control space sorry control s control s i press on control then s button s for snake 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 okay similar i just press on control s and look here look here there is i can see anything control s something wrong maybe yeah it doesn't look like any green sign okay however you see maybe dependence is already there just it took second even we cannot see it even I yeah see maybe dependencies are here okay but we also download and install test ng but test ng is not yet here yeah. we have to bring the test ng how we can bring it In every project. just click on project then right button go to properties. build path or properties you can go to properties so properties click on properties then java build path click on java build path then add library add library click on add library you see test ng is there click on test ng click on next okay then click on apply whenever i will when i i will click on apply you can see test ng here okay Click on finish, finish apply. apply. You see test ng already there. Is there yeah. Okay, then apply and close. Now we are ready. We are ready. You see, it took only five minutes to set up all my project. Okay, if I set up manually without using Maven it would have been taken 30 minutes or more than that okay now i just take i choose src test slash java i click here right button click then i create a package and i name it test cases you see package always starts with small cap small letter okay then click on finish and test cases package has been created then right button click i'm going to create a class okay and name of the class is facebook login test okay facebook login test or i can say just login test whatever yeah no problem i can name it anything but it should be meaningful then i just take public static void main okay or even without public static void main i can use test ng no problem at all but first i want to show you how we can just use public static void main method then just click on finish and login test class has been created and inside login test class we have a main method if you forget to check in main method no problem don't worry at all just type main then control spacebar press on control hit on spacebar okay press enter 
and main method will be there. Okay. Now we know what to do. Okay, we know what to do. Okay. I just want to copy some of the text from previous project. Okay. So that I don't need to type it again and again. And I can explain it very quickly. Okay. I just paste it here. These are notes. Okay. What are this? This is notes. What we are going to do, we are going to test login functionality of Facebook. And this is a test case. Say, for example, this is test case one. Okay. What we need to do to test a login functionality of a Facebook? Let me show you. I just want to go to to test the test Facebook first I have to open the browser first step is open the browser then type https colon slash slash facebook dot com this is our application URL and we are going to test it press enter okay and we are inside the facebook application we are inside the facebook application okay then what step we should take if we want to test we have to enter uh a gmail okay enter correct email then enter password okay then click on login button, login button. now mr ignatius tell me if i enter correct email address and enter correct password and click on login button okay what do you expect what do you expect mute. ignatius you are muted you have to unmute as per actual result yeah result is you expect user can log in right mm -hmm. user should be log in user should be able to log in so expected result is user should be log in right mm -hmm. and when i click here when i click here you will see also actual results okay now when i click and when I click, you see the user, meaning I, able to log in. What do you think? The expected result and actual result matches or? This one. Yes. Matches. This is actual results. Actual results. Actual results is ma matches e expected result and actual result matches meaning tests is test pass right test yeah. pass okay if it doesn't match tests fail okay fail you understand okay fantastic if you can understand it, you become software engineer. Manual software engineer. Now you become manual software engineer, okay? So we 
we test it manually and find if test pass means this software is running smoothly it doesn't have any defect it doesn't have any error it doesn't have any bug okay we tested it manually okay what we have done mm -hmm. is we tested it manually and find it is pass pass meaning this piece of software is functioning smoothly there is no defect no bug no error okay we tested it manually okay this is called manual testing manual manual testing okay and one who tests manually they are called manual manual tester okay now we tested it manually but company want us to test it automatically using automation tool using automation tool now we are going to test it using automation tool that is called selenium okay we are going to use selenium let me show you how we can use selenium okay we are going to use selenium okay no worries our step is first open browser then navigate to navigate to means go to https facebook.com enter correct email enter correct password then click on login button this is test case and every test case has test steps how many test steps are there how many five okay so we are going to follow these test steps to test our software automatically using automation tools automation tools that is selenium with java we are using selenium plus java programming language we already learned little java and whatever we learn that's enough for now to run automation code to write automation code okay now how we can do it first we have to tell selenium to open the browser okay let me tell selenium to open the browser let me tell to open the browser okay how we can do it we can say web driver web driver is a class and say driver equal to new chrome driver chrome driver see how i write chrome driver chrome driver and i can import this chrome driver okay i can import it you see chrome driver and i can also import this web driver class and it has been imported here okay now then i use this driver driver this is 
reference variable to this new object okay now you can think about java what we did in java in java we create new object and we are creating new object here from web driver class okay you can also use chrome driver here no problem you can say chrome driver if it confuses you you can use chrome driver driver new chrome driver from chrome driver class we are creating new object new chrome driver then we are using driver this driver okay this driver then just using dot operator dot operator when we use dot operator you can access all the methods and properties of selenium whatever they have in built or built in okay now i want to use get method you see get i'm using it press enter and i want to use this url to test the application so i just copy and i just paste here okay actually open the browser and navigate to facebook.com okay so let me just make it little understandable so that easily you can understand okay you see now I say navigate to facebook.com I write a code for navigate to facebook.com driver get https okay and we are going to facebook.com let us check whether it is working okay run as java application it's invoking the browser okay you see chrome driver was started successfully and navigating to facebook.com you see now it opens half now i can tell it i can tell driver driver hey driver go and manage 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 is another um, method and how it will manage what it will manage manage window manage window window manage window actually you can just put dot and it will show you manage oh manage not sorry manage what Window. window you see window is there yeah. all right yeah. then how it will manage maximize okay maximize now now you can see it will maximize the window okay it's invoking the browser navigating to Facebook now maximize the window okay now what next we want to test it next one is enter your email right 